Welcome back folks to Let's Play Journey to the Center of the Earth, a game where we so far encountered no Leviathan sea creatures, but one protagonist who's only now realizing that she's not in Kansas anymore. Let's go! This is probably where Adam lives, <coughs> in seclusion, on a mushroom. Or maybe not, who knows? Only one way to find out, and that's to go over there, very slowly. Oh no, it's uh, probably easy enough to get up there. As you can see, there's a little spiral staircase that heads all the way up. And the flag! I wonder if it's of a nationality that is uh, from the surface. We'll find out. So I can't go that way. Oh no, yes I can. <coughs> Up we go! <laughs> Brisk jog to the mushroom. Oh. Who's there? Uh, hello. I'm Arianne, a photojournalist. Hello. Lieutenant Lenkoff. What can I do for you, miss? Okay, not quite what I was expecting, and also, who's this? Right in front of you, Lenkoff. If you haven't noticed her by then, you are blind as a bat. It's a bit strange, but could you tell me where I am? You're at an army outpost on the inlet, in the wild zone. What are you doing here? I had a fall and woke up on the beach near an old camp. Hmm. Are you from the surface? Yep. I don't know what you're talking about. I think the answer to your question is yes. I have to tell my friends what happened. Would you help me, please? Sorry, lady, but I can't do that sort of thing without authorization from my superiors. I've got other priorities. Great. Have you seen my pilot? No. Nobody's passed by here in a long time. What about Askium? I was told that there's a town, Askium, where I might get some help. Hmm. That's true. To get there, though, you've got to take the suspension bridge. And I've no idea what condition it's in. Great. That's a fine mess I'm in. I've got to get out of here. <laughs> it's a fine mess I'm in. I've got to get out of here. What, this game? No, no, the... the area I'm in. Are you sure you don't want to get out of this game? Wow. These mushrooms are... How on earth could they grow this big? Well, the elders have studied them a great deal. But all I know is that they're sturdy enough to hold our observation post. Okay. So I see. Though I doubt anyone will believe my photos. Did you actually take photos? I saw some graves down there. Are any of your ancestors buried on the beach? Ivan Platonov was my ancestor. He was a great Russian scientist. And a member of the expedition led by Armand Latifier. Okay. What about this problem? Is there a problem? My mate's injured, and I've got to evacuate him. What's he got? A broken leg, apparently. First, we need something to ease his pain. I've got something to ease his pain. What does he need? He has a fever, and his leg needs to be splinted before he can be moved. Okay. I'm going to explore the area. Be back soon. Uh, why? I've never seen a soldier like him before. Well, I've got something to help with the pain. Did you learn much from your stay, Arian? Yes, thanks. Uh... I'll be back. Be careful. I could just... No? How... Do I give him the... No? Never mind, apparently. There's nothing for me to grab. This here. is beyond belief. I'll have to make sure my report doesn't look like pure fabrication. Good point. Hi. <laughs> Hi there. Hey, little sister. Is it true you're off snapping pictures in Iceland? That must be really incredible. I'm going to see Dad with the kids. Do you think you can make it? Bring Being with our family makes us all stronger. How did I get reception at the bottom of a volcano in a mystical land full of giant mushrooms? 3G is awesome down here, clearly. What's going on here? Oh no, I can't answer. I hope my SOS got through. The answer to that question is probably no. I'm just gonna throw that out there. Probably no. Can I go over this bridge? No. So I need to help him, but... Clearly... I could combine the bandages with the... No? 
Did you learn much from your stay, Arian? Yes, thanks. I'm not making much progress with easing his pain, am I? I'll be back. Be careful. I'm really not making any progress. Do I need to wear the gloves to do it? No. No, that's not going to help me at all, is it? Okay. Down I go, I guess. I can go this way a bit. Perhaps I'm missing something. I should have all of the solutions I need. Okay, there's no horrendous, evil, gribbly monsters that are going to kill me. There's always a plus, but there's also no items for me to grab either. Adam might be here, perhaps? Maybe he can give me a magical healing tincture or something. Alright, there's a suspension bridge nearby. It doesn't look like it's in good shape. I don't need to be close to it to see that. It looks to be in terrible condition. Wow, it's taking a while to get there. Yeah, this thing doesn't look good. Oh, what's this? Hello? Um, rope to it? No? Knife? Why would I have anything to do with this stump? Ooh, knife there? Aha! Look what I have. Flat piece of mushroom. We use that as a splint, maybe? I bet I can't even cross this yet. Oh my. SOS received 10 p.m. June the 5th, 2005. Rescue workers are on their way. They will need two days to get there. Hang in there, rescue team. Oh, brother, two days? Well, in the meantime, I'll try to find out some more about this place. Let's hope I can find a way out of here and my pilot is safe and sound. Unlikely. Two pieces, flat pieces of mushroom. I get just on the off chance. Could I go back and use the flat pieces of mushroom to create splint? That could work. Although my word, it's going to take about five years for her to actually get back. We need some fast travel in this game, but I don't think we're going to get it. Also, how on earth are we getting emails at the bottom of a volcano? Technology has not become that pervasive. It doesn't go through the fabric of wibbly-wobbly magical lands. Or does it? Who knows? Who knows? It might. It probably doesn't, though. Okay, we're back. That did not take as long as I thought it did. You see, it just says ease pain, but... If I can't give him a tube of pills... This says aspirin to kill the pain. Will this help? No. Did you learn much from your stay, Arian? Yes, thanks. Pills. S ah, splint! There you are. You can use this to steady his leg. Thank you very much. Nice. Can be easy. What does he need? He has a fever, and his leg needs to be splinted before he can be moved. Right. I'll be back. Be careful. Well, I just want to give him the pills. I have pills. They're right here. Apparently not, though. Hmm. Why won't it the game? Did you learn much? Yes. I'll be back. Be careful. Why can I not give him the pills? Do I need to combine the pills with something? Open them with the knife? Light them with the... no? Hmm. 
Okay. Let me try to figure this out. Give me a moment. Okay, I've just had a thought about something. We have aspirin. What do you tend to take aspirin with? You tend to take aspirin with water. Problem! We don't have any water. I know somewhere where there is water, though. That's all the way at the beginning of this little area by the beach. Although that's salt water. And I hope that logic does not dictate in this game that I need to provide this guy with salt water so that he can uh, take a pill. That will probably make him feel much, much worse. However, let's see. For all I know, that could very well be what they need. Also, we're not going to indicate anything about this. We're just going to walk by it. This works, though. Hurrah! We have fixed ancient... It's not Atlantean? Journey to the center of the Earthian technology? Askian technology? Askii technology, maybe. Okay. We have a flask. No? No, that's not gonna work. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, we need to fill this up. But where? Okay. What? Apparently here is where we fill this up with water. I wasn't wrong! Wow, if you had not got that, like I hadn't, that's a lot of backtracking to fill it up with salt water. Unless this isn't salt water. Although if this is a sea, I'd be surprised if it was a... a non-salty sea. So now we have water all the way back to a beach to get water so that we can give this guy aspirin. So all we've done is put some mushrooms by his legs and given him aspirin. Excellent. That's good. We're back here though. Two days. We have two days to refine the pilot, get back to the surface. And if it's anything like the um, the story, I think I know how we're getting back to the surface. But I'm not going to spoil it for anybody who hasn't. You just think that there's a thriving civilization down here. Well, I say thriving. I've met an entire three people in it. And one of them is a man who believes he can cast magic. And two of them are soldiers. So... Hmm... Your guess is as good as mine as to if this place thrives or not. Hello. Did you learn much from your stay, Arian? Yes, thanks. Pill, there you go. Have him take this pill with water. It'll kill the pain. Thank you very much. Uh, how is he? How's he doing? Much better now. But to evacuate him, I need to call our pterodactyl. And our conch is broken. Wait. Your pterodactyl? Listen, Ariane, we've got to hurry it up. Well, I'd probably better not make him angry. Maybe I could try to fix your conch. Yes, please give it a shot. Try and fix the conch. Right. When we come back, folks, we have to try and fix the conch. But what's wrong with it? What's the matter with it? The outer shell is broken, and the chambers within are worn with age. I don't know where to find a new one. Hmm. Well, let's see what we can do about the conch. So, I'll catch you later. See you then. Later.